Hello everyone, I'm Lonnie with Untitled Nerd Network, and uh, I want to talk about what, what seems to be like a gender gap in uh, cosplay. And one of the things that we, uh, like the, the point that I want to hammer home for this video is if you are a male cosplayer, where there is a will, there is a way. Because I see a lot of males are kind of disheartened, uh, they feel left out, they feel like they're not good enough because, you know, to be completely honest, the cosplay landscape, as far as the like commercial cosplay landscape, you know, the social media, the Patreons and stuff like that are dominated for the most part by female cosplayers. It's just the fact of life. It, it's what happens. Um, but just because of that doesn't mean that you're completely out of luck when it comes to cosplay. And number one, the number one thing that you have to do as a male cosplayer is try. And I've had my finger on the pulse of the cosplay community for the better part of like three years now on a very, very consistent basis. This isn't something I've just kind of been back and forth on. I have uh, amassed a network of literally hundreds of cosplayers. And the number one thing is a lot of male cosplayers just don't want to try and that is the biggest obstacle number one you have to try and to really succeed you have to try hard and I think that really goes for everybody like like I said where there's a will there's a way for example over the last 100 days on Untitled Nerd Network 100 cosplayers out of those 100 only nine were male that's it and that is just from a lack of people not putting in for, uh, you know, our cosplay competition. You know, if more males would enter, more males would take part. You know, it's just simple math. You have to try first. Out of the last 100 days, according to my numbers that I've compiled here today, we've had 14 all-stars, and that is 14 people with at least 50 reactions in the 24 hours that their cosplay profile photo was up. You know, they were able to qualify for All-Stars, our December competition for the Amazon gift card and Cosplayer of the Year and all that. Out of those 14 All-Stars, only two were male. So that means out of the nine males, two qualified for All-Stars. That's like 20%. And that, that, that actually shows me that the male cosplayers who try are trying hard. You know, they're, they're actually putting forth that effort. Whereas, meanwhile, it's like uh, 12 out of 91 of everybody else. So that's just a little over 10%. So the males do a little bit better percentage-wise getting into the All-Stars. But the, the big thing is, you know, like I said, if you, you have to try and you have to actually try hard. You're not going to get anywhere by sitting around complaining Oh, you know, the you know the other gender gets all the love. It's possible to make it if you put forth the effort. I'm Lonnie with Untitled Nerd Network. Thanks for watching.